Hello and welcome back to Magic Karen Strat. I'm BinkyB and this will be the second match with uh, Blue Black Gifts Control and this is a Mulligan. I will keep. It's a pretty bad hand but we will keep. Like a Signet in this hand becomes like the best hand ever. Snow cover planes. Thirst is not horrible either. Gives us something to do on turn three. Planes, planes is not that threatening. Pro is pretty <laughs> interesting though. Especially before, uh, or that you played planes before probing. So if this is always going to do, I'm gonna gifts for Iona and say white. And uh, that might be good enough. If I place like a Thalia here, that would be really bad. Suppression field. Uh, okay. That's okay by me. I could have thought this here to make sure it's okay, but if he's not going to do anything. It could be the mono white enchantment. Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, sure. And it's possible I should have played the Thoughtseize actually. Well, that's awkward. Uh, stitch those, I guess. Well then we will gifts for Elishnorn on burial rights. Have to be vigilant here so he doesn't play um, Leyline. Have to gifts in response to that. Hmm. Okay. If he names Iona, that's fine because <laughs> I will win this game anyway. Uh, if he can't play another spell, okay, uh, fair enough. Burn uh, rights. Elishnorn. I'm done. What you gonna do about it? There will be no more spells for you. This has an instant way of messing with my yard or something. There is no window for him to like path Iona. Yep, that's the power of Iona. So mono white enchantments, that's pretty bad, I have to say. I guess the gates and maybe disdainful stroke and we will take out Dismember, Doomblade, Murderous Cut, save all the fatties. Is Leyline better than anything else? I don't think so. They might have like a god I can bribe. That doesn't change anything though. Unless that's their only win condition. I think you just have to live with having some... I mean Damnation is at least... Actually Damnation is just straight up better than Murderous Cut I think. I just have to hope that he doesn't start with a Leyland of Sanctity because then things will be hard. No black mana, other than that it's a pretty good hand. No Leyland, right. Step 1. I would like to draw a black source right off the top if I can choose. Swamp would be acceptable. Another thought is... 
is a bit mocking, but all right. Now I'm just satisfied with lads. Yeah. Lance and I will probably win. Just one lance so I can thirst for more lands will be sufficient. Signet. I will take a signet, I guess. So what can he add to stop me here? Leyland of Sanctity is the only card that I can think of from the top of my head. Yep. Naming thoughts is or gifts maybe. Thoughts is. <laughs> Yay, we drew the stainful stroke. I'm trying out that card. I mean the main reason I have it in is for stuff like Tron and, and that because if if you're playing against that deck Mana leak becomes bad pretty fast and the gate doesn't take a card like Wormcall Engine. Land. Ah, come on. That's just not fair. Yep. Do I actually get to disdainful stroke something? Uh, I will Mana leak that for sure. There is a reasoning for just letting it resolve and man leak whatever it does next, but if I draw land I want to thirst so bad. Uh, you're still mocking me are you? Alright, Demir Signet, you're up. I land and we're good to go. Then we can gift for Iona. Nevermore. Can't be played. Cost, okay. Well, we can still thirst down the stuff in the yard. Guess you can name on burial rights. There is a reason for both, I think. Case cast gifts for value. Where some burial rights will be good if I draw it. Gifts and given, okay. I can stand behind that. It's gonna take two here. I won't be able to play uh, gifts, but I can play Snapcaster Mana Leak, for example. Or Thirst. Sure, probe away. I'm gonna go Snapcaster Beaten on your ass. So I have a count spell for anything big. I'll probably just throw in Snapcaster Mage. Even if I can't get Mana Leak. If it plays like a land and something for two. I'll probably, yeah then I can't do anything about it anyway. He has another ruined Halo. That would be bad. Probe is pretty nice in that deck. I haven't seen that before but I mean. Knowing what you should name with Rune Halo and Nevermore and stuff is pretty good. So now it's the big question. Do I Thirst or do I Snapcaster? Snapcaster it is. I think it's okay. I mean the mirror segment is not that important to me. But just getting Snapcaster into play is pretty nice. Now you can have like plain rune halo snapcast mage. That's fine. Perfect notes. Fair enough. So I could thirst. I already have two dead cards. Yeah, I'm just gonna play the mere signet. Crap. Should know this by now. I 
I mean, I'm fine with that trade, I suppose. Can't play anything large. If I can't counter it with the Stainful Stroke, I will Thirst. Because I have two dead cards that I might as well get rid of. But yeah, missing black on the first two turns, or missing lands, I guess. Um, in total, is pretty bad. But if I could have thought this like the Rune Hailer and then thought this the Nevermore, I would have be, I would have been in a pretty good spot. Uh, Yeah, I'm just gonna play this. If you wanna nip my thirst, that's fine. And I actually have enough. Oh, really? Ha! There you go. I'm the king of the world. So this is also useless. Uh, let's see if I can do this correctly. Um, do I want to save a Demir Signet? I think so. Okay. Uh, let's ditch Thoughtsies and Gifts. Now, alright, we can play Swamp 2. We have Negate, Mana Leak, and Elish Norn coming out in. One land, one turn, hopefully. That would be a pretty big swing, actually. But I'm not sure if I would just jam it, because it could have wraths and stuff. But having two count spells here is pretty nice. And since he named Disdainful Stroke over Thirst, he has to... Hmm, it would probably name Snapcaster. I, you know what, I'm just going to man like that. It's like, hardly not worth it, but I have him on a two turn clock if I do it this way and draw a land. Rest in peace, alright. Okay. If he has a Wrath of God, I would be pretty sad. Other than that, he's dead next turn. Wrath, Ghostly Prison doesn't do it. Another Rune Halo. Banishing Light does it, I guess. Tarpet is nice. Now we have Snapcaster. Yeah, this match is going at the right way. I think we will have him within a turn. There's Halo, and I can't negate that, which is unfortunate. And this also active. Then I will just use you. You're dead in a turn. I will have negate up for rune halos. Whatever you could muster up. Because you can't win with this right now. Looks like it will be a GG. And that's pretty nice. Yeah, Cyclonic Rift here. Boom! Cyclonic Rift, end of turn. Uh, untap. <laughs> Play like Gifts and Umbreal Rights on Iona and just win the game. Mm -hmm. Seems good. His deck is not great at handling stuff at instant speed. He might have a path that doesn't do it. Knar, Monoscrew, GG's. 
Yeah, I mean, I'm not sure how many lands he runs, but I guess. Drone Catacomb, Drone Catacomb. I would have thirsted end of turn, drawing those. Scarring, Termination, Disdainful Stroke. Untapped. Okay. Thank you for watching, I'll bring you two more matches. Another day. For you it will be another minute, for me it will be another day. Thank you for watching.